The founder of the worldwide phenomenon known as Burning Man died today in San Francisco, though the party moved to the desert in Nevada years ago. But the roots are still right here. ABC 7 News reporter Lisa Amin Galician has more on a special memorial tonight in honor of Larry Harvey. To Larry. To Larry and all that he started. To Larry. To the spark. This is where Burning Man started in 1986 with a small bonfire on Baker Beach by this man, Larry Harvey. Since then, it's grown into the worldwide phenomenon it is today. He has really managed to do something few people in the world have done with no commerce, no religion. It's not a cult. It's a wonderful community. And on the day of his death, strangers, yet like-minded people, gathered to remember the father of the annual event they love so much. It was always meant to be shared. It was always meant to be participatory. There are no spectators. But it's not Larry, it's you, and it's you, and it's you, and it's you, and it's, you, and it's me, and it's everybody. It's, it's the 70,000 people right. who come together and to celebrate. Burning Man is just that, a celebration of art, of humanity, of coexistence, and its current home in the Nevada desert. A gift has an unconditional value. It can't be a quid pro quo. It's a way of life many have shared for more than 30 years. The word community is constantly used when it comes to Burning Man, and it was the online community that brought this group together on this night at this time.